Welcome back to Xenotic. We have got a corker of a game right now. We have Uncle Wolfie or Wolf Snipe versus Champ. Wolf Snipe, definitely a very well played uh, Xenotic player on this channel. Champ, much less so, but definitely a well played Xenotic player in general. Both of these guys, I think, will come out fairly evenly matched. This is Blood Run, so it is one of Wolf Snipe's favourite matches. And Champ is pretty good on this one as well. Here, Wolf Snipe just trying to float around the back of the map, try and find where Champ is, try and suss him out at the start of the game. Champ has a much more aggressive playstyle, going in as fast as possible. And picking up as many items. Beautiful catch there. One of Wolf Snipe's best tricks. Definitely caught me out a lot of times when we've played on this map. Always seems to know where you're coming from and able to lay a trap right where you are. The patience to wait out that. Champ definitely knew where Wolfie was. But definitely wasn't wanting to push it too hard. Wolfie getting good position here. No kills just yet. Which is fairly late for a champ game to not have any kills but Wolf Snipe definitely cancelling out the uh, Cancelling out the aggression of Champ. And there's the first blood. Wolfie managing to pick it up but goes down quite quick to a respawning Champ. A nice flick shot there from Champ. Landed and keeping the... Uh, or taking the lead. I was going to say keeping but he didn't have it. Wolfie. A little on the back foot here, having to move backwards, Champ pushing him very aggressively. Now three to one up. And you can see Champ has slightly more taken control after the first two minutes with no kills. Now Champ's opened it up and really pushed in hard. That respawn frag. That seems to have really changed the game and swung the power into Champ's favour. Nice placement of rockets there from Wolfie as Champ yells to do it on LAN. Nice little fight and Wolfie's going to land beautiful rockets. Finds Champ round the corner, that's a good amount of damage. Champ must be on about 10 health right there. But moving back up, he's going to be in a position Wolf Snipe can get to him. He's in a few good positions. He's been getting caught out in places where he can always fall back. Wolf hasn't been able to catch him in a fully tanked up position that he can't pull back. And especially in a position he can't pull back at all. Whereas he can pull back fully right now pull back into some health just being able to get him where he can only pull back into another room with no health in it would be a pretty good position for Wolfie at the minute but Champ wants to keep this under control Wolf looking to speed it up a bit though Tries connecting a few shots. 3-3 three to three the scoreline still though. We're approaching the halfway mark. 
Champ's fast around this map. But Wolfie knows where to sit, where to catch him out. There's no point in being fast if you're just very fast into running into your opponent. Exactly proved as I say it. As Champ repeatedly runs into Wolfie. The rage is on. And now Wolfie's starting to take control of some of the items back. He hasn't been able to keep any items for more than one or two rounds. Hasn't been able to fully control anything so far. Just been able to really get a good position and control the map that way. Champ's managed to get one back. It looks like a traded out frag though. So Both players back on even terms in terms of stack. And now both wanting to get some sort of major item. The Mega Armor's up. The Mega Health is up. I think both have just been taken by Champ. Wolfie on the back foot. Four minutes left in the game. Very carefully avoiding making any noise around that corner. Very well played. Comes in. Good shots coming out from both players. Wolfie getting very low. Where's Champ though? Champ's over. Champ's down. Champ goes down. Wolfie's got an 8-4 to four lead. Champ can't quite make the jump. I think that just been knocked off. And Wolfie picks up a tiny bit of that 50 health. Which helps him to survive. And now absolutely running away with the frags. The respawns come out. It is a massive thing on this map. Getting these respawn frags. Being able to trap people when they come off of the spawn. And now Wolf Snipe really wanting to find some items here. Because Champ's going to try and pull back into this. We've seen what Wolfie's been able to do in the last two minutes. We can surely see what Champ is able to do in three so Wolfie's got to be very careful here to not lose it in the last few minutes. He's definitely got this controlled. Heading fast down ramps. They meet up at top. Wolfie gets away. Champ looks like he's going to try chasing. Champ's going to chase in. Find a frag. And there goes the Mega Armor. Wolfie finds a beautiful rail. That was a very impressive rail. You can see the control style of Wolfie coming out here. And Champ, you can see when he aggressively pushes in, you can see that he's an aggressive style of player. Very fast around the map. Very controlling. Whereas Wolfie's just going to try and sit and control certain positions on the map. Especially while in the lead. Sitting here, waiting for Champ to come through. And just controlling this tiny little section of the map. Goes down, but manages to do a fair bit of damage. Just waiting on that respawn, trying to confuse Champ. As Champ's going to be flying around the map. As fast as he can to try and find where Wolfie's respawned. Wolfie's just going to delay it for as long as possible. And that's going to throw Champ off a little bit. Or at least we'll be hoping to. With a minute left. Wolfie's got a four frag advantage. It's definitely not quite enough to just spawn delay. But it's pretty good. He's going to push through that was a good move from wolfie actually not pushing backwards where champ would have been able to catch him off unfortunately champ spotted him on the move through and now he's just got to try and last 30 seconds with two frags of lead if champ goes down in this fight it's absolutely it for champ 15 seconds left and three frags between them Champ's got no chance, I don't think. 
into this. A very, very close game from start to finish. Trading frags all the way. Wolfie played that extremely well, keeping himself in the right place. And at the end, it's GG. Congratulations to Wolfie for beating Champ. Thank you very much for watching. Please send your demos over to me so that I can cast them. I am MX Craven on IRC and otherwise you can find me in different places on the internet. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next one.